मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स माई सेल्फ नेहा अश्वानी फैकल्टी ऑफ माउंट लिटवा जी स्कूल झांसी टुडे आई एल बी टीचिंग ई वी एस क्लास थर्ड चैप्टर फोर फूड एंड बैलेंस डाइट ऑलरेडी वी हैव कम्प्लीटेड अ मेजर पोर्शन ऑफ दिस चैप्टर टुडे वील बी डिस्कसिंग द लेफ्ट ओवर नाउ हियर वील डिस्कस द इनटेक ऑफ फूड विच वैरीज विद जेंडर एज एंड फिजिकल एक्टिविटी नाउ इनटेक ऑफ फूड The amount of food that we eat is referred as the intake of food, the quantity of food, the amount of food that we are consuming. You now, the babies, the children, the teenagers, parents, grandparents, they all need the different different food stuffs, and we all don't eat the same quantity of food. The amount of food needed by the people. depends majorly on the age and the activity levels like what sort of activity the people are doing whether they are doing a lot of physical work or they are doing the mental work now coming to the first one that is food for small babies the infants or the newborn babies they do not have teeth they cannot eat the solid food so the mother's milk is best for the infants that is children of 4 to 5 months they eat the semi liquid or the semi solid food like we start giving them khichdi kheer mashed bananas etc so can they can easily digest it now the young children they need a lot of amount of body building and the energy giving food as the body is also growing now here you can see the small babies how they what kind of food they eat they only drink milk and as they grow to 4 to 5 months they consume the sol semi solid food now coming for the food for teenagers now who are teenagers the children who are between 13 to 19 years of age are known as teenagers they are very active and they do a lot of activities so they need a high level of energy so because this energy is needed for their developing bodies as the child is growing so they must have 3 to 4 or 5 you can say small meals or you can say snacks a day they should not eat late at night and you should also avoid eating junk food they should have a proper balanced diet a proper quantity of vitamins minerals carbohydrates everything in proper quantity and even they should consume dairy items such as milk yogurt that gives them energy and that gives gives them calcium which is very important for the growing bones and at least they should drink eight glasses of water every day as you know these teenagers you all have to study hard a lot of activities have to be done so these things are very very important now coming to the adults part food for adults in the age group of 30 to 60 years as the life is very busy with the household chores for mothers and families and for the fathers it's very busy with their office work and all so they need a proper diet in this group they need less amount of calories and a more amount of vitamins and minerals they should consume more of vegetables and fruits and less quantity of ghee butter cheese that gives them fats because as you can see in the picture the mother how much work she has to do cooking office work cleaning of house and what all is not there and the father as the father is also busy with the work that is office work you can say now coming to what are who are they grandparents now we'll discuss about grandparents food for the grandparents people who are above 60 years of age should eat the food that is easy to digest and should have the food that is rich in calcium or you can say ragi green leafy vegetables milk and even seafood as they need a lot of amount of calcium and calcium will make their bones stronger but the food should be consumed in little lesser quantities now coming to think and answer now children a chapter is completed here are a few questions that you have to do i am reading out the questions Ravi's grandfather is sixty-five years of age. What kind of food can he eat 
to us to maintain a healthy lifestyle just think an answer why do the teenagers consume more amount of bodybuilding food what do you think does the bones becomes weaker as the people become older means as you become older will do you think the bones become stronger or they become weaker what kind of food is consumed by infants that is the small babies write few lines on health is wealth here you can write five to six lines on health is wealth now children with this we have completed the full chapter that is food and balanced diet i hope the chapter is clear stay home stay safe